today you guys are going to see gameplays that you never should have seen. They should have been thrown in the bin, never made it to YouTube. But today I am saving them just for your eyes so you can see things that don't really go well behind the scenes when I'm trying to get a video. So normally when I get a video for YouTube and I'm going for a specific gameplay, I have an end goal in mind. Maybe I want to get a certain kill streak. Maybe I want to show off a certain gun in a certain way. But sometimes it doesn't always go to plan. I almost get that gameplay and then something goes wrong. And as a result, the gameplay's done. The gameplay's over. It doesn't matter what happens from that point onwards. I'm never going to share it because it's not good enough in my eyes. And it's not good enough for you either. However, today I've saved some of those clips which normally I would have deleted. I'm going to show you guys what happens when I'm almost about to get that great gameplay. But I just fail or something goes wrong and as a result the video is almost void so this clip right here is from level one of my brand new prestige so every time i prestige the first game i play of that prestige i will try to get a gameplay with a decent score so then i've got a video basically saying oh i'm back to level one and i can still do okay but honestly most of the time when i'm level one and i'm in a lobby like it, i don't do quite as well as i want to like i always have high standards for myself and although on YouTube you'll only see like really my best selection of gameplays, I still have bad games. There's just no point in sharing them. I'm definitely not some sort of Call of Duty god. I've never really put myself out there as being the best at the game. I just enjoy it and I, I mean I'd say I'm above average. Um, and it's just an example of where, oh, nice, nice kill there. You know, things are going well, but they just don't quite work out, unfortunately. So I'm level one right now. This is like the big clip, the big streak clip that could have saved the gameplay. We only have a few deaths in this gameplay. I think about four deaths. So if I went 30 and four, for example, definitely a gameplay worth uploading, especially if I was only level one using a basic, basic loadout. On the right hand side, I've got quite high kill streaks on UAV, Talon, and Wraith. So again, for a level one kill streak setup, if I can get them for me then I've got like the biggest things I could have gotten in that gameplay and I can turn it into something really good so I've, I'm, I'm on new town no I'm not new town cheese what I'm talking about I've got a new town camo on and I'm on skyjack so it's a close quarters crazy map where anything can really go down at this point here 250 150 score off getting my talent things are going well obviously there's a counter in the air that's not really playing to my advantage it was sort of like slow me down a little bit in the back of my head at this point here I might just chill out and I'm always thinking, especially at this point in the gameplay, that if I just calm myself and do well, I have a video, but if I freak out and do something wrong, I've wasted time, and as a result, the, a video that could have been will not be. This is the deciding point, 50 score left. If I get one single kill, I at least have my talent. Normally I want to get all of my streaks though, and if I die just off of my final one, I kind of see that's like an unpolished gameplay in a way, so I really want to get both of my streaks. I'm just looking for another kill right here. Can't see anyone. Oh, whoa, some gunfights going down there. I'm like, what the heck? I can't find anyone. Things are slowing down. It's not good. Bam! Shot in the freaking back by somebody that had spawned in the place I just looked at using the bow and arrow. And that's the end of that gameplay clip. But I've got more than just one example. So one video you may have seen recently was me talking about the best specialist in the game. And it was just basically me giving my opinion on why I use a specialist, why I like it so much. But to really back up why I liked it so much, I wanted to get a gameplay with big score streaks. The score streaks that really wouldn't be easy to get in a normal situation. But using combat focus, which is my favorite score, uh, my favorite specialist in the game can really help me out really benefit me so for a little while when I had a little bit of time I was putting on big score streets like in, in this example the Talon the Raps and the GI units so everything was pretty much above a 10 kill streak I didn't even have a UAV on there to really show off how well this uh, combat focus could work it was stressful though because if I didn't get all of the score streaks I wouldn't use it and I would get close a lot of the time and it still just wouldn't go my way. Basically, it was just, it was tough, all right? So I had quite a few fails where really like the gameplay was fine, but it just wasn't the perfect gameplay that I wanted to really utilize and show in the video where I talked about the best specialist in the game and in my opinion. So here we're struggling a little bit. I've uh, picked up a BMP with a silencer. I like it, so I'm sticking with it. It's, it's a good weapon, right? And at this point in time, um, I want to try and stay in the streak. It's a brand new game. Haven't even died yet. I could potentially get a flawless high kill streak game to really show off exactly how combat focus works. So we're close here to the Talon. Things are going all right. You know, nothing to complain about yet. This is a great gameplay. We're seven and zero right now. You know, it, it is potentially got can be uploaded to YouTube, and you guys could maybe see it one day. This can be a risky gunfight. Ooh, managed to finish it off a little bit of pre fine going around the corner. Always very useful. So this is where the gameplay is made or broken. I need to use combat focus I need to get several kills with combat focus 
So boom, I've got one kill of combat focus. I've got my tan on. Got at least half my combat focus left. I just need to find one more person. Maybe two more people. If you've seen the video, you understand why I'm saying three in total. What? Freaking shotgunned in the face around the corner. Nothing I can do about it. And for me... Despite the fact I'm 9-0 right now, I've got my tal on. I could go on to get a great gameplay score-wise anyway. It's just not good enough. I've left it alone. And as a result, really, you never should have seen that video. So, guys, this is my final example for this video. We've put about three together into one. Again, this is the same situation as the last clip where I was trying to go for all. Just a really good gameplay using specialists and some higher score streaks. So the GR unit, the rats, UAV. I think I've been going for this for a little bit longer now. And I was like, you know what? I'm just going to ditch the third high kill streak and just shove on the UAV as long as I can get the two high ones and really show combat focus in use doing a great thing then it's gonna work and that's awesome now um, I, I mean like some of you guys may watch this and be like you know what Ali like you didn't do exactly what you wanted it wasn't exactly perfect but you can still use it but I think for me like the, one of the reasons I love Call of Duty so much is that if I have a great gameplay that wasn't perfect I will still look at that and pick apart what wasn't perfect and think I want to play more Call of Duty so I can do that game again, but do it perfectly and do even better. And I think that's what draws me back every time is just the, the, like knowing that if I played even better, I could get you guys even more amazing gameplays. Um, if I was just doing perfect every single time, it would be boring and also I, I couldn't, I can't be perfect every single time. Um, but that's one of the reasons I come back to Call of Duty so much is just the idea that there's so much potential in the game with big score streaks. Like I just like trying to go for something which is as good as possible possible and here this is where it's made or broken rocked combat focus got a kill got shotgunned <laughs> man if you remember my haymaker video i talked about the fact that like i always got killed by shotguns in pretty much all cool duty games but never really used myself i just wasn't i don't know if i was, wasn't good with them or if i just sort of left them alone but shotguns can mess you up in the most annoying situations and it did it twice there for me unfortunately but there you go guys three gameplays that normally would have been just thrown in the bin no one would have ever seen them but instead today you guys can see some fails what it's like going for a game play that I have in mind it just doesn't quite work out hopefully you guys quite like this idea maybe if I try and go for another big like gameplay or something and I get a few more fails I'll put them together in another video for you guys if you like that give it a thumbs up and hope you've enjoyed a little bit different something you wouldn't normally see from me on my channel so hopefully you've really enjoyed hope you had an amazing day check out more videos on screen here if you haven't seen them and I'll see you guys very soon as always with a non-fail gameplay so I'll see you guys then